Okay. Yes. Hi. Hi. What is your name and where are you from? Uh, I'm Nakshatra and I'm from India, but I'm staying now at Spain. At Spain. Okay. You're from Spain. Great. Okay, Nakshatra. Which standard you are in? Third standard. Third standard. Okay. So uh, myself, I am uh, Suhas. Okay. I am your abacus teacher. Okay. I'll be teaching you abacus. Okay. So this is called a abacus. The uh, this is the teacher's abacus. Okay. Uh, and I uh, I'll introduce to you one more thing. This is what we call as a student's abacus. Okay. This is student's abacus. This is called okay. Japanese soroban abacus. What is it called? Japanese uh... soroban. Soroban. Abacus. Okay, this is Japanese. Story. This is the student's abacus and this is the teacher's abacus. Okay, so you'll be learning this. Okay, so I'll explain it to you the parts of abacus first of all. Okay, keep in mind. Okay. Uh, this is okay. This is abacus, Japanese soroban abacus. So whenever I will ask you what are we learning, so you have to say abacus. Which type of abacus? So then you have to say Japanese soroban abacus. Okay, what will you say? Japanese uh, soroban uh, abacus. Good, good, good. Okay, so we'll see the parts of abacus first. Okay, this is the outer frame of abacus. What is this called? Outer okay. frame. Outer, outer. This from outside. Okay. So first is outer frame. Second is this is the middle bar. Okay. It is in the middle, so it is called this. This is the middle, so it is called a middle bar. Okay. Outer frame, middle bar. Okay. And these standing ones are called rods. What are those called? Rods. Rods. Okay. And these are beads. What are these called? Beads. One is called a bead, a bead, and more than one are called beads. Be beads. Okay. Now the beads about this middle bar. This is the middle bar, and the beads about this middle bar are called upper beads. All are upper beads. What it? Upper beads. Yeah. And the beads below this middle bar, below, are called lower beads. All are called lower beads. Lower beads. Okay. Now the value of upper bead. The value of upper bead is five. What is the value? Five. Means each bead which is above this middle bar carries value five. Okay. Now okay. each bead below this middle bar carries value one. Means this is one, this is one, this is one, 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 all are one. Okay. So okay. did you understand? The beads above this middle bar are called upper bits and its value is five, and below are called lower bits and the value is one. Every bead has carry value one. Okay. When will the beads get the value? When mm. when the beads will touch the middle bar, then they will get the value. Okay. See, if I am touching one bead here, what is the value? Can you tell me? Uh, one. Correct. Bead. Correct. One. It is one. Why one? Because the value of lower bead is one. If I touch one more here, what is the value? Uh, uh, How many beads? Two. two. Obviously. Now? Three. Now? Four. And if I remove this and this add, what is the value here? One. What is the value of upper bead? I told five. you. Yeah, the value of upper bead is 5. So always remember when the bead is touching from upside down, the value will be 5 counted as 5. Okay. If I add one more here, what is the actual value? Count. Uh, 1. Total 1 total and total this is? 6. Yes, 5 plus 1 is 6. If I add one more here, what is the value? 7. 8. 9. Smart girl, smart girl. Super. And if I remove all, what is the value here? Zero. Yes, means no bead. None of the bead is touching the this middle bar. Means the value is zero. The abacus is in the zero state. Okay, got it. The abacus is in the zero state. So you know you are. You are uh, can you see the black dots here, right? This middle yes. middle dot. Okay, is called our ones place. What's it's called? Ones place. You know ones place. Ones tens hundreds. You know yes. no. So this is our ones place. Okay, so that is why you decide no one, two, three, four, and this is total line. Okay, got it. So this is one's place. After once, which place comes? Uh, tens. Yes, you are right. And if I add one here, what is the value? Can you say? One. And here? Uh, zero. So what is the total value? Ten. Yes, it is ten. If I add one here, so what is the actual value? Uh, uh, 11. Yes. Come on, say. 11. Um, 12. 13. 14. Uh, uh, 90. Okay. If I add, what is the actual value? Can you tell me? Uh, 20. And here? Yeah. Um, uh, mm -hmm. 25. 25. Mm -hmm. And here also, no. 6, 7, 8, 10, 29. See, you have to count this every. These are 2 beats. Okay, 2. And here, 9. 
Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine. If I add, so what is the actual value? Can you tell me? Eighteen. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So here nine and here nine. Nine nine is ninety nine. What is that? Ninety nine. If I add one more nine here, what is the value? This is our hundreds place. So nine hundred and ninety nine. Okay. Ninety nine. So nine hundred and that is called triple nine. Okay, triple nine. If I add one more nine here, what is the value? Um, ten thousand. No, nine thousand. Nine thousand. Nine hundred. And ninety nine, okay. Ninety. But what we'll call it? It is called as a quadra nine. What is called quadra nine? Quadra nine. This is single nine. These are double nine. These are triple nine, and these are quadra nine. Okay. The term yeah. used for four numbers, four which are repeating. Okay. It is called a quadra quadra number. Okay. So good girl, you know it very well now. Now we'll move on some activity. Okay. I'm asking you certain activity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We'll move ahead. I'll be asking you certain cards. Okay, you have to uh, just recognize them. What is the number? Okay. Okay. It's simple. Simple. How much? Uh, seven. Superb. Superb. Um. Uh. Six. Where? Four. Wow. Nine. Yes, you are right. See nine. Okay. Now I'll ask uh, double digits. Let's see. Can you do it or no? Okay. Ready. Four. And here. Four zero forty. Forty. Yes, four zero forty. Twenty. Correct. Yeah. Uh, forty. Yes. Uh, just no. Fifteen. Fifteen. Yes, you are right. Good. We'll move on to triple digit. I'll ask some triple digits to you. Let's see. Can you, you can guess it or no? Ready. One, one, one. Uh, five hundred. No, five hundred and fifty-five. Yes, triple five. You are right. Triple five. This one. Five hundred forty-four. You are right. Go ahead. Try this one. Uh. Hundred and four. Correct. One zero four. You can say it as one zero four. Okay. We'll try some uh, four digits. Let's see. You can get it or no. Hold up. Hold up. Yeah. Okay. Eight thousand. Eight thousand. Eight triple zero. You are right. Five thousand and is it five? Five thousand six. Is it five? five? No, it's not five thousand. Count out how nine. many how many rods are how many bits are in this rod? Nine thousand. Ah. Nine thousand five six nine 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 nine. Yes, it is quadra nine four times nine, so it is called a quadra nine. Good girl, good girl. One more, one more. Yeah, can you say? Count okay. the beats. Nine, nine thousand and uh, fifty, fifty, uh, fifty six. Correct, correct, correct. Good, good, superb. Nakshatra, superb, superb. Yes, you can know it. You can know it. Okay, good. 